All right, y'all. Today, Feral Interactive has been keeping me super busy. First, this morning, we get a super patch for, for Tomb Raider. Then, F1 2015 is released. Uh, you can go check those two videos out. Uh, and now, we're going to check out our benchmark. Uh, as you can see, we are running it on ultra high. And I'm using my camcorder because I'm having issues with my recording software, which is OBS Studio. And I just can't be bothered to fix it right now. And this is probably better because it doesn't present a load. Uh, while you're recording, it presents a load to the to the um, computer, which may affect the benchmark. But anyways, uh, so what we have here is ultra high. Everything turned up to 11. And all the other uh, nifty visuals turned all the way up. And as you can see, on uh, on i7 with the GTX 780, that's a uh, i7 5820K with the GTX 780, no overclocks on either one of them. Uh, we're getting approximately 50 to 60 frames per second. I'm sure that you can go in there and tweak the settings and find the one that is affecting you the most, and so you can get the steady 60 if that's your thing. But even as it dips below 60, I'm not noticing any uh, weirdness or things that will distract you while you're gaming no skipping none of that so that's awesome uh, this is the same game once again as uh, that was made by the people who made grid so it was made by code weavers and ported by feral interactive uh, so you can expect pretty similar results and I would say that grid played amazingly well on Linux This is the uh, built-in uh, game benchmark, and it's a it's, it's a pre uh, I don't know it's pre whatever. And <laughs> the game is running on its own. We'll just say that. How about that? Uh, I'm at a loss for words. I can't find the word, man. But yeah, so the, uh, this is the in-game benchmark, and it is doing its own thing uh, while it's doing it, and we're still sitting about 60 frames per second. So the benchmark's finished. And as you can see, there was uh, 5,601 frames that were rendered. Uh, we have a minimum of 39.5 frames per second, but that was probably pretty brief because I never saw that. And then we have a maximum of 66 frames per second and an average of 55.75 frames per second. So that's at ultra high, keeping in mind. So I'm sure that I could, uh, you know, tweak around with the settings and get it super, super locked in at 60. Uh, and have an amazing experience but anyhow once again appreciate you watching thanks to Feral for the uh, for the opportunity to check take, check out this game they did provide me with the uh, with the game and you know what I'm out peace